Joining us now, representing Russia, ladies and gentlemen, Natalia Zabioko and Alexander Endert. So the Russian team takes the ice right now, Natalia Zabiako and Alexander Enbert kind of trying to hold on to their position, where they are to, to be able to make a run at the Olympics. This is a team that came in third at the national championships in Russia last year and fourth at Skate Canada, one of the early events on the Grand Prix. Beautiful long lines, classic Russian tradition in their skating. Very nice triple twist. They head right into their side by side. Triple toes. Beautifully done, a bit far apart. Johnny, you mentioned Russian line. When you think Ru pairs history, you do think Russian first. So dominant, Soviet Union and Russia for so many years. Alexander actually train with Nina Moser, who teaches Ksenia Stalbova, Fyodor Klimov, uh, Tarasova Morozov, who are currently the top Russian teams. Both have already secured spots for the Grand Prix final. And for many people, Zabiaka Enber were going to be the third to entry for Russia at the next Olympic Games. However, this season they're sort of being overshadowed a bit by Astakhovod Organov. So it'll be interesting to see at the Russian Nationals how things shake out. Johnny, they've got to be a bit nervous just knowing those first two spots, first and second, are probably a lock for those other two teams. The thing about this team, though, is that they are very elegant and they're very nice. I can't say that anything really stands out to make them special from the other Russian teams, but there's very nice, elegant skating, fast, long lines. It's pretty to watch. They have everything and they have nothing. Hmm. Classic clean skating, and they need the consistency of clean programs, and that was definitely, you know, they got through it really strongly. However, they when, lost my attention about halfway through. When countries are looking for who's going to represent them at the Olympic Games, they want superstars, and this team doesn't have that star quality. And, and yeah. they also don't have momentum at the moment. Natalia Zabiako and Alexander Enberg from Russia. Back with Zabiako and Enbert in the kiss and cry. They made it to the World Championships last year. They were fifth after the short, but just a disaster dropped them to 12th. Shown there in the kiss and cry with Vladislav Zhevnersky, another part of their coaching team. Really nice triple twist, but not, not quite enough to go for that plus one. It was just a nice, as everything was in the short program. And their side-by-sides were beautiful, a bit far apart. It makes it much harder the closer you are to your partner. But they I, got the job done. I do love this style on them. It really suits them. However, they should be going a little bit more dramatic, a little bit more Russian theater. This is just sort of, it was love story. It was nice, but just sort of dishwatery yeah. kind of interpretation of the music. You know. Alexander you know. From Russia. Everything but nothing. Program score. So I heard. <laughs> so 70.15. And again, you, back to your 80 step. standard for the top teams. The team and obviously not as high as what we just place. saw from the team from China. So into second 
place overall.